Hi, welcome to Gadget Cafe TV. I have three different types of machines here that I wanted to show you. Uh, the first one is the Gadget Classic, which is a traditional machine. I also have a Cafetli uh, capsule machine and a, a Nespresso capsule machine. And I wanted to show the different types of coffees that go on uh, these machines. The Nespresso capsules, you find uh, this particular one, you can use Nespresso capsules, uh, but you also can get Nespresso compatible capsules. There are hundreds of thousands of these, uh, probably millions of these machines. Uh, the newer ones have a slightly different size, but the older ones have got uh, the standard size of capsules for Nespresso, Nespresso compatibles we call them, and you can use them uh, on these machines by just inserting them. Now the one that I have here is the Cafetalis uh, Nespresso compatible capsule. You can have different brands of Nespresso compatibles. Nespresso has its own capsules. Now this Nespresso compatible capsule uh, has something like five, uh, sort of six grams of coffee. I, I actually measured this one. This has got six grams of coffee. Now when you go to the uh, Cafetoli system, which is very similar, but they actually have a uh, eight grams of coffee in their capsule so you'll find that they are much larger if you look at the two different sizes you'll find that one is uh, much larger than the other uh, so this has got eight grams of coffee on an espresso type of coffee you will find some which are for uh, ca cafetal system capsules which have less coffee and maybe more coarsely ground like for instance this originale originale uh, gives you a filter type of coffee so it's a faster flow whereas the espresso coffees will be a slower flow more like a 25 second extraction or something like that uh, they also do tea capsules as well now on a traditional machine uh, you have got the ability to put ground coffee so you can gadget as its own ground coffee but you can buy coffee from uh, different uh, roasters you can get them in supermarkets but make sure that you get uh, finely ground coffee uh, because if you don't have the finely ground coffee and try to use it on a traditional basket you'll find that the flow will not be uh, for the right kind of espresso. It will give you a coffee but it won't be good enough for uh, espressos. So you really need to have uh, very finely ground coffee. The machine itself comes with three different baskets. One is called the perfect crema basket. That will allow you to use more sort of uh, supermarket types of coffees. It doesn't have to be too fine uh, because it has got two layers uh, so if I show you that, that, ha that actually has got a, a perfect crema basket which has got two layers and a s tiny hole on the bottom. That gives you a nice creamy coffee but if you wanted to use uh, the traditional baskets which, are, which you will find you know, lots of holes uh, so it's a single layer and the machine comes with a 16 gram and a 7 gram basket. The 7 gram basket you can use ground coffee as normal but you can also use pods. Pods are very similar uh, to the capsules but they are not uh, in plastic they are in a uh, paper bag. Some of them will be individually wrapped now the gadget one is an individually wrapped paper bag. Uh, so you have to put it into the basket so you'll use the traditional uh, single basket and then insert the pod and then fit it in as normal so you can it is quite versatile so you have got the ability to 
uh, use pods as well as ground coffee on a traditional system. The advantage with traditional systems over capsule systems is that your cost of coffee will come down if you actually use ground coffee. Uh, especially if you grind your own coffee, you can actually reduce the price, reduce the cost quite considerably. So if, for instance, a bag like that, you can buy from uh, all kinds of prices, from three pounds upwards to uh, eight pounds. This, I think, is about six pounds, 95, or thereabouts. Uh, but uh, say even a six pounds, 95 uh, coffee, will cost you only about 20 pence because it, it can produce something like uh, 30 coffees using that. Whereas a capsule will cost you about 30 pence or thereabouts. Uh, the pods also cost the same, cost about this 30 pence or so. So you can actually choose the different types of coffee machines. The capsule machines produce a very good coffee every time it's the same uh, sort of uh, size and co no, not the size but the the coffee itself will be very very consistent whereas on traditional machines you really have to maintain the the quality of the coffee this the ground coffee and how you tamp it there is a bit of skill involved so but if you are really into coffee and want to try um, uh, the different types of coffees it's a really good thing to have a traditional machine. Gadget does quite a big range of uh, traditional machines from per, uh, pressurized filter holders to a traditional filter holder. This is a traditional filter holder or porter filter we call it and this is very heavy bra brass uh, chrome plated and it's very similar to uh, what we get on professional machines. So it's a really uh, heavy filter holder but the, on the lower end of the range we have pressurized filter holders uh, have a look at them on our website the cafe Italy capsule system we sell the capsules for them and also the machine so you can get some links on our website the nespresso machines we don't actually sell on our website but we sell the nespresso compatible capsules so there is a range of Nespresso compatibles that you can actually try. Uh, and this is the, the basic range, basic types of machine. Now the, the next level up is behind me, all the automatic machines. There you just put the beans in. You can use ground coffee as well on automatic machines, but they are very versatile. The cost comes down on the coffee, so if you drink uh, two or three coffees, three coffees a day uh, on a capsule system you'll probably spend uh, about a pound uh, a day uh, which means 365 pounds whereas uh, for the similar amount of uh, consumption you'll find that uh, uh, instead of spending 365 pounds you'll be spending about uh, maybe uh, 150 pounds so you have a, a massive saving on uh, coffees when you use either bean to cup machines or traditional machines. Have a look at, uh, at the full range on our website gadgetdirect.com. Subscribe to our YouTube channels. There is quite a lot. Uh, there are lots of videos, product videos, product reviews, uh, cleaning videos and so on on our website, uh, on, on our YouTube channel as well as on our website. So thank you for watching and hope this has been useful to you.